You're watching the Geico Top Flight Invite presented by the United States Marine Corps as a part of the Border League. And today, one team will leave Las Vegas with a championship as Virginia Gold, comprised of players from Oak Hill Academy, faces California Basketball Club, made up of young men from Sierra Canyon High School. All wing. His high energy style of basketball makes him stand out. This guy's impressive with his versatility. When his feet are set, he can knock down threes. His strength of the game is slashing to the basket. He gets there and finishes with body control and athleticism. And then Kajani Wright on the other side for California Basketball Club. Look at that number. That is not a misprint. Our graphics department did not mess that up. 26 rebounds yesterday. He's headed to USC. And CBC decked out in white here in Las Vegas for the championship. Both of these teams 2-0. Take a look at our starting lineups brought to you by the United States Marine Corps. Chris Livingston, part of that starting lineup, and gets it to go to Kentucky Kimoween, one of the top sophomores. And Mike Price, one of the top juniors in the ESPN rankings as well. Three of 30 yesterday. And that's how you win close games. Make your free throw. And love that hit ahead pass by Foster. You mentioned that. Do commit. Getting that one to go is and what he did not play yesterday with a little shoulder injury. Perhaps he was uh, wanting to make sure he was healthy today. Peach Jam. I remember watching him from North Coast Blue Chips in the eighth grade. So I watched. You form a club team. You find action. You find teams. You form leagues, and you get on the floor. Back. There is a lid on the top of this basket. Can we break the seal? Also, I haven't played that many games up to this point, and plus they're dealing with those injuries as well. CBC tries to answer, cannot. Virginia Gold with a 10-point lead, make it 12. That's Chris Livingston. Livingston has nine for the game. Chris Livingston impacts the game with his energy. Major finisher. Runs straight to the basket. That looked like Justin McBride, actually. 21. Oh, but, but Chris Livingston, he's an everyday player. Off and running again. Mr. Chris Livingston, the Kentucky commit. Half. Here's a look at Livingston in transition. And half of their points have come in transition. Jeremiah Diarco says, oh, no thank you. Tim Rudowski gets that one to go. Says, finally slashes to the basket and finishes like no other in the class. He's a good three-point shooter with his feet set, but that's where he impacts the game. Getting out on the break, finishing in traffic, attacking the offensive glass. Chris Livingston brings green. And off and running again, Tybo Bailey. Nice little intermediate, Jay, they're up 15. In this game, sat out yesterday with the injured shoulder. You can feel his presence in this game. Mike Price, that is a C5 NBA draft picks. Three ball, right? Here's Livingston. Foster, nice little pump fake. Step back three for the Duke commit. Little Caleb Foster. Going back the other end, Mike Brown. Latoyer finds his teammate, Ramel Lloyd Jr., off the front of the iron. Price again. Virginia Gold lead here for Virginia Gold, continuing to push the pace. Here's Duke commit Caleb Foster off the back of the iron. Trying to come up with it and putting it in is Jeremy Gregory. East Tennessee State commit. Had 16 points yesterday. And doing some Amon's work here today. Decision for the kick out. You want to get the last shot of the half, maybe leave a second or two for the offensive putback. Good clock management. Okay, what shot? Shot. Right now. 
misses that one, but just one of the few things to go wrong for Virginia Gold in the first half. A 15-point lead in the oh, top flight invite presented by the United States Marine Corps as a part of the board. Here at Canyon High School, 15-point margin in the final 16. Isaiah Halloween, nice start there for one of the top sophomores. To Johnny Wright, we'll have to get going early in the second half. Nice little slip and dish. There's Jeremy. Oh, nice strip there by Xavier Brown. Brown with a little two on one. But Devin Ree unable to finish. Caleb Foster got that one to go. The Duke commit from three. See, Livingston thought about it. Said, you know what? My teammates. At the end of these 14 and a half minutes. Even when CBC does something right, it goes. Halloween spinning on Foster gets that one to go. Isaiah in sophomore class. All the way to the rack. That's Mike Price, one of the top juniors. CBC with that half court track. They did the same thing yesterday against Dream City and it worked. Price oh, gets the blocking call. And one. Defense creating some. Offensive opportunities. Yeah, that's a block. Took it so deep. AAU program in Charlotte. I love the way he's developed as a leader. And off the glass and in with the contact. And once again, Isaiah L. To the finish. A little flex right here. Ready? A little bump. Yeah, that was me. I finished. Got a lot of size on the floor here. Move, move to the start. Freezes the defense. Beautiful. Three ball. California Basketball Club. Led by a couple of youngsters here today. What are they going to call here? Quite day today, but he's going to play for USC. Yeah, USC also has a five-star. Vincent. He's the type of player who can still help a team win even when he doesn't score. Ooh, there's Caleb Foster, the Duke commit. Foster catches it right to the rack. No wasted motion. He's a very good decision maker. He's not a big risk taker. One of the winning is important to Caleb Foster. the three. We got an 11 point game here at the top flight invite championship game. And that was with the rebound. Three ball is good. Four and Caleb Foster seems intent on helping his team capture that. 15 points, seven rebounds, three assists, a steal, and a block. Paul Biancardi. What I love about Caleb Foster, even when he doesn't shoot well, he still plays well. We saw the defensive rebound, the push, and the assist. Make no mistake about it, he's one of the best shooters in the junior class, but some nights the ball's not going to go in the basket. His mind still... Turnover still of the day. Yeah, he's a low turnover guy. Jim Rudolfsky. Virginia Gold goes on to win this game. You can look back at that. Here comes Mike Price. Price with a head of steam. Spin move up. The glass, no, they didn't need it. Puts that one in. California Basketball Club, Paul Biancardi making it look interesting. How about that spin and body control by Mike Price? And another turnover. Three on two. for Virginia Gold is very talented, much like CBC. That's why they're in the chip. Rebound, CBC. Here's Mike he Price. Kick. Mike Price. Reverse lane is good, and we got a two-point game. And this looks like a completely lost Virginia Gold team in the game. One of the top juniors in the country. Gives it off to Kajani right back to Godofsky. Rudofsky, here's Elohim, one of the top sophomores in the nation. 
Williams. He's got 25. Three on the shot clock. Dribbled out of bounds, and that will be Virginia Gold Ball. A much needed defensive position. Again, you're going to get trapped. Two on the ball, that means you got to get rid of it with the pass and not the dribble. Head to Livingston. Livingston to McBride. McBride to Gregory. No. Comes to Virginia Gold and putting that one through is Tybo Bailey, much needed. For CBC. Rodowski in the high post nearly gets that one poked away. Here's Matoyer. Kick out. Here's Price. Finds his way to the basket and gets it to go. They get the offensive rebound put back. Halloween, the draw. Reverse lay and no. Wright was there for the follow. But we've got a whistle. To the top. Makes one of two, 30 seconds to go, one point game. That one nearly picked off. Foster outside to Bailey. No. So Foster, it's Tybo Bailey at the line. Misses the first. One point game. They got a timeout if they want it. They're going to let him play. Ten seconds to go. Halloween loses the basketball. And Chris Livingston has it. They're going to have to foul. And they do. 1.5 to go. Isaiah Halloween tried to make it happen, lost the basketball. Might be running out of time. I like the drive. I love the help. Two bodies come over, jumped up in the air, really had nowhere to go. Not sure what to do. He should have just threw it up. Maybe Kajani Wright was inside, could have got the offensive rebound. Still going to be a one possession game. And you have a timeout. Well, if you are CBC, you want Chris Livingston to make this shot right here. Now you got a chance. And they call a timeout. Exactly, because on the miss, the clock runs out. That's right. So one. Warriors set to inbound. Home run ball, gonna have to get it out. Not enough time. That one count, it does go in for Elohim. But not enough time as the officials waved it off before it left his hands. It went, but it does not count. And Virginia Gold wins the Top Flight Invite Championship 70 to 67. What a finish. Big time performance by Virginia Gold. Great fight by CBC. They back screen, throw it to the middle. It's a home run play to the wing. He didn't get it off in time. If there's 2.5 left, it's good. If it was 1.5, and it's not. Frankly, half a second more, and maybe we're talking if about over time. Yeah, if there's two seconds, we're playing five more minutes. Virginia Gold, 2021 Geico Top Flight Invite Champions. It was not easy. Looked like it was going to be, but CBC made them earn it. And they hold on to win it 70 to 67. There's Christian Reeves holding the trophy. Livingston with 13 points. And how about Justin McBride with 16 points as well? Virginia Gold hits 20 of its 33 free throws. Hit eight threes and hold on to win.